Hi, this video here is going to cover the topic of how to uh, assemble a keystone uh, faceplate for an RJ45 uh, outlet. And um, basically, this is part of a wide range of products we've added onto the tvtrade.ie uh, website to, to take advantage of the, of the increasing popularity of broadband and its integration into the use with satellite equipment. Okay, so basically, if you look here, we have uh, two um, versions of the faceplate. We have a single faceplate here and we have a double faceplate there. And um, th just to quickly, the other range of products we have here would be things like the pre-terminated um, uh, Ethernet cables, the RJ45 um, uh, connections here, the jacks. Um, we have RJ45 joiners here and also have a range of different types of Cat5 cable, um, Cat5 cable testers, punch tools, uh, stripping tools and also snips, things like this, they'd be using in conjunction with it. But back to the main show here, which of course is how to assemble this RJ, um, uh, RJ45 uh, keystone plate, okay? So we do here, um, we can see there's three basic components to it. Um, there's the keystone here, the two internal parts, the whole the keystone, and then the actual outer uh, plate here. So I'll, I'll just start off with the outer plate here. It comes basically in two sections. Uh, it can actually come pre-assembled on the thing. What, the reason that you pull it apart is, if you wanted to mount this onto the wall, you might drill a hole here, uh, put a screw in to lock this into position, and then clip this faceplate over to give it a nice and neat, neat finish on it, okay? So we do actually come along and I'll just show how this clips together like this. Uh, sorry now, just very quickly, clips there. Uh, so we'll come along anyway, and I'll just go through the steps here. So I'm just gonna move this out of the way for now. So I'll pick up uh, the keystone here, and it just slots in directly into this here. So I'm trying to do this in a manner which I can do it without blocking your view. So we, with the first part, we're making sure that this lip is going to go inside the holder here. That's fine. And then what we do is we just press down, and we clip it in like that. So that's locked firmly into position there. So the next step there, so you can see it here, the next step there is to get this and to put it into the next section, which is here. And that clips into position like that. So that worked quite well. So that's locked in there, okay? And then the final thing is to get this and actually to insert it in here. And it can, it'll actually, it's total square, so it'll go in anyway. And just push it from the front back in. And that's it, it clips in there like that. And then we have an Ethernet cable, so this is what we have over here. We can actually just come along and we can just slap that into the faceplate like that. And it just works quite well. So that's it, it's almost exactly the same process for the double faceplate here. So, um, you know, the, the, Basically, if you want to build your own uh, Ethernet network, if you have cables in the wall, things like this, you have just followed the, the information that we have uh, to do with the various different products. And also, we'll say, uh, we have wiring diagrams, things like this, on the, the website. Um, so, from beginning to end, we have every piece of equipment for building your own uh, Ethernet uh, network in your house. Okay, um, uh, that is the Keystone uh, RJ45 faceplate, single and double.